If you want a super durable bag that you can take on the court and it has absolutely everything you would ever need when you're playing tennis, pedal or pickleball, this is the bag that you need to check out, the new ADV bag version 3. When I reviewed the version 2, I was still full-time coaching. So in that V2, I needed everything that I need for coaching. Of course, my rackets, cones, everything, several layers of clothes. I have now changed my role a little bit, and now I'm pretty much only a content creator, which brings different issues. But that is where the V3 is big time helping me, because everything that I need to film, plus, of course, my tennis equipment, fits in here. And of course, I want all my equipment, everything that I need, well organized. And again, that is where ADV comes in. And they've made some upgrades. And I think those upgrades really are a testament to the fact that ADV really listens very, very closely to user feedback and comes up with very practical, very smart solutions. So let me show you the upgrades. And of course, the good old features that make it well worth it looking into the V3. The third version, of course, is also a six racket version version you have your two end compartments here and one of the updates is that those are a little deeper and a little bigger so you really have absolutely no issues getting the rackets in out you can easily close the zipper here boom all safe and in this other side here I don't have any more rackets but usually that's where my tripod goes uh, this is a ball picker upper uh, handle if you will this is a fence mount so all kinds of things go in there and they stay in there well organized before we get to the middle compartment because there were some changes there I'm also going to point out these extra sleeves in here Into those sleeves, for instance, you can put pickleball paddles. And I am using them to have my strings or my grips right there. Everything that goes on the racket is in the racket compartment here. So that's a change. You have the same on the other side. As in the old version, you have your two hooks that you can use to obviously hook the bag to the fence because you don't want to set it on the ground. The bottom is super sturdy material. And it does get a little dirty, but I'm not worried about that. On the side here, you have your two little bags. And I use that here, for instance, for my phone. And another update here on that small pocket is a little key loop. <laughs> that helps me because I always lose my key. In the second smaller bag here, you have more compartments. One here is lined with felt. So glasses, for instance, can go in there. This here has a zipper. This has stayed the same. And it's really good to keep everything, of course, well organized. Another update are these two extra handles. So if you have the bag zipped, you can just carry it here. The straps do come off. You can just simply pull them out. These rings down here are now aluminum so they're super super sturdy nothing in this bag will break and i do have to admit did i need a new bag uh, from the version 2 no i didn't because my other bag is still perfectly fine i've used it a lot it is still in great shape it is being put to use in other things but i wanted the new version because it's really really cool so once you unhook these straps you can just clip them onto the back and then slide them in here at the top. And there are now two different hooks where you can put them in. So you have different lengths of the straps. As with the V2, the V3 also has the cooling compartment that easily fits actually two of these 1.5 liter bottles, keeps them nice and cool. You got one more extra compartment here on the side. You can put folders in there, papers. Some people use it for iPads or a laptop. Either one is perfectly fine, but again, it keeps everything really organized. And then two more updates. This is the shoe compartment and it is separated here and they've added a little bit of reinforcement up here. So this is very easy to slide things in, extra pair of shoes, dirty clothes, whatever you want. So it makes it really easy now with that separation to slide your shoes in and the material of the bag itself is not getting tangled up anymore. 
The hidden ID pocket is well hidden. <laughs> That's an update. Um, it used to be in the sleeves here, but it's now on the side here. It now also has a zipper, and this is great for ID, cash, or a ring, something that you really want to not have as conspicuous sitting around. Let's look at the middle compartment. As I said, the shoe compartment is basically attached here with these little T hooks that you can then simply put in here or take out and the material, you just pull it out the other end and clean it. We have some mesh compartments here and one more update that I really need. And that is that little compartment right here. It is lined with a poly film. And I usually have my sunscreen in there because usually I spill a lot of sunscreen. And if anything spills in there, you just simply wipe it off. So that's a really great update. This is all the stuff that I usually have in there, plus more, a couple more layers of clothes. And they all easily fit in here and have their space so that I can find them easily later. ADV Pro Bag version three is the ideal racket bag for me. And I'm sure it will be for you. And it's gonna be even better if you use the discount code that I'm putting down below in the description. And also make sure to check out the ADV backpack and that review will come up in a couple of days.